Hello, if you've ever bumped into the problem where Webflow won't let you upload a file, it says it's uh, unsupported, then I'm gonna walk you through one possible solution, one way you can get around this issue. Um, I had this problem here on a page on MemberStack where we were trying to give people a way to download a JSON blueprint. Um, this is something cool Make lets you do. But the uh, same is true for like zip files and there's a bunch of other stuff that Webflow won't let you host on their servers. You have to host it yourself. So I'm gonna walk you through how to do this or how I was able to do it here. The first thing you're going to need is a Google Drive account. And what I recommend doing is creating a folder where you're going to put all of your files. From there, you can share that folder and make sure that anyone with the link is able to view it. That's important for this. Then uh, you're able to create individual folders for projects, you don't have to do that. You can also just upload files. So we're gonna grab a JSON file. Um, I didn't mean to open that. And just drop it in here. Now we can see it's automatically shared because it's inheriting from the folder. And then what I do, is I click in here and I then click copy link. Perfect, so this is going to contain an ID which we will need. Here inside of Webflow, I've used a little bit of custom code to create this button. And what we're doing is we are assembling this link. Um, I'll include this in the uh, description for the video, but that all gets assembled in there. We will save this. Um, and then real quick, what this looks like on the published site is I just click this button. It loads. And it downloads the file. Now, if you're not using the Webflow CMS, you could just take that link, manually assemble it. Um, otherwise, if you are using the Webflow CMS, then you'll do something like this, where um, you're pulling in the ID using the CMS field. So yeah, I think that's it as long as the share settings on your Google Drive are set up so that anyone on the internet is able to view it and then you just use the same link structure that I provided, uh, you'll be able to allow anyone to download a file that's hosted in Google Drive. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. Feel free to leave a comment. I'm happy to help. And uh, yeah, I hope this works well for you. Have a great day. Bye.